Tonight, the violin viewers will tune in to see 12 new singletons head into the villa in hope of falling in love. The news will come in the form of a text sent to Jack Fincham last night and will read, Boys you must get up early and sneak out of the villa while the girls are asleep tomorrow you'll be heading out on a lad's trip. You must not discuss this with any of the girls. Wake who called boys and tour. Casa Amor's doors will be open and the boys will slip away unnoticed while the girls are still asleep and as they rise, brains go into overdrive with the girls speculating on whether they will be joined by fresh faces. Viewers will also see Donnie Dyer, who is currently in an official relationship with Jack, admits she feels uncomfortable with the impending changes. Me and Georgia are the ones that are freaking out the most and we're the ones that are really getting on with our couples at the minute. I am nervous, course I'm nervous, I don't lie. Ellie and Laura want new boys. I can't lie. Oh no. The barmaid says. Host Caroline Flack will also make an entrance, gathering the girls around the fire pit confirming their thoughts. I bet you didn't expect to see me so soon. Shall we have a chat? She begins. I can imagine it was quite weird waking up without the boys this morning to Casa Amor. Well I can reveal that we've sent the boys away on a little mini break. They're going to spend the next few days getting to know six new girls. I'm not just a bearer of bad news, I've also got good news. This means that you're going to spend the next days getting to know six new boys. I hope you like them. You might even want to keep hold of some of them, she says. Single Giardy Ellie Brown who was previously coupled up with Alex George will be extremely excited about the new arrivals. Are you trying to give me a heart attack? I am not laying it on factor 50 thick. Speaking in the beach hut she reveals, I mean. Six new boys. No you've got to play it cool, otherwise I'm just going to look desperate and I'm single so I can't come across too much. Over in the boys' new surroundings, viewers will see them greeted with the following message, boys. Welcome to Casa Amor. Have fun. You'll be staying here for the next few days. Boys will boys new valet rules. But Jack is quick to declare himself a no-go zone as he rules himself out of getting to know any new girls because of his relationship and commitment to Donnie. However, in walks Jack's ex Ellie Jones and she instantly heads for the Essex lad stating she has unfinished business to sort out. Will the arrival of Ellie reignite old feelings Jack once had for the brunette? And does this mean that Donnie and Jack's relationship is in jeopardy? Meanwhile, Megan Barton Hansen admits her uncertainty after spending the last days seeing Wes Nelson following that shock split. It comes after Megan broke up with recently dumped Isle Booker and confessed her feelings for Wes, in which he then told Laura Anderson he would be getting to know Megan. Viewers then saw an emotional Laura give Wes an ultimatum, if he wanted to get to know Megan, Wes and Laura were no more, and that's exactly what happened. And now that Adam collared a single following Zara McDermott's dumping last night, will one of the three new brunettes turn his head for the fourth time? The Violin airs tonight at the later time of 9.15pm on 2.